That was Brandon Heath with It Is Well With My Soul. And when your soul is in the right place, and of course, when it belongs to the Lord, you can pray for others with effectiveness. And so today, I'd like to pray for pastors and churches. Father, today, I'm grateful for every proclaimer of the word. And I pray especially today that your power, your authority, your anointing, your enablement, your wisdom, your clarity, and your boldness would be upon each one. And Father, it is so important, especially in what's going on today in our society. Last night I was chatting with uh, people from our Bible study, and we were talking about the fact that there seems to be an awful lot of chaos and confusion going on, but there is one stability, and that is you. And I pray today that, Lord, as your representatives, as your restraining and enlightening force in our society, that, Lord, we would stand on thus saith the word of the Lord. I was thinking about an interview that Billy Graham had with Johnny Carson back in 1973. And Johnny Carson was asking Billy Graham all kinds of questions. And Billy kept on saying, the Bible says, finally, in a little burst of frustration, uh, Johnny Carson said, you actually believe every word of the Bible? And Billy Graham said, categorically, yes. And so, Father, today we have a stability, which is the Word of God. And, Lord, we must proclaim it, Lord, unabashedly, unashamedly in our world today. So, Father, enable us, Lord, to do it with real wisdom and with love as well, because, Lord, we have basically <laughs> an audience of people that either don't believe us or, secondly, Lord, they don't understand us. But, Lord, with your anointing, we can, of course, be the best representatives and ambassadors in our world. So, Lord, help us, Lord, to do what it says in Matthew chapter 20, uh, 28, verse number 19. Lord, go into all the world and bring the gospel. And secondly, Lord, let us follow what Jesus said in John chapter 15 when he said, People will know that you're my disciples by the way that you love one another. So help us, Lord, to be very wise, but very loving in our society today. And we thank you, Lord, for your anointing and your wisdom today. And we ask all these things in Jesus' name. Amen.